Hello, my name is Gustavo Correa and I am a second year computer engineering major studying at UC Riverside. Today I will be presenting my 120B embedded systems project for spring of 2017. Uh, the topic of the project is an uh, audio visualizer um, and the way I created it was I received input from both a microphone and from an audio jack and I displayed the sound amplitude on the LED matrix of this cube. Um, I will be describing the complexities that I use for this project as I describe the path of data coming from the audio source all the way to the cube. Um, and to begin, the first complexity that I used is that I received audio input from an audio jack. And as you can see here, I have two sound amplifiers. Um, and they're both amplifying um, the same sound coming from an audio splitter. Um, from the sound uh, source and the first amplifier amplifies the sound to um, output the music on from out to the speaker and the second amplifier amplifies the sound um, to send the signal to the microcontroller right here. Uh, the second complexity that I used was a microphone and same concept. Uh, the microphone sends the audio input to the microcontroller right here. Um, the third complexity that I use is this Nokia display that I will be using for the menu. And on the menu displays um, off, microphone, and auxiliary. Um, the fourth complexity that I use was I transmitted the audio signal, the ADC input from the microcontroller to the Arduino via USART. Um, and what the Arduino does, it displays the sound to the cube. And for a quick little demo, I'll be pressing play right here. And at the moment it's off, but if I press the middle button, goes to microphone input. So at the moment it's microphone input. Now if I press the right button, it takes me to the audio input from the audio jack. And now if I turn off the music and I turn off the, uh, and I switch back to the microphone input, now it's only displaying microphone input. Thank you very much. That was my 120B project for spring 2017.